Madam President, I rise alongside my good friend and colleague from Cumberland County in support of Senate Bill 350. This legislation is very simple. It will require all agencies which issue permits to increase transparency throughout the permitting process. It will require the agency to post information about the permits that they issue on their websites and will create an accessible tracking system for applicants to check the status of their applications. Similar to what we have seen in the private sector, like Amazon Prime deliveries or ordering takeout from a restaurant, you should be able to track your permit from the beginning to the end. Back in January, Governor Shapiro acknowledged that we have a problem with permitting in Pennsylvania. To his credit, he signed two executive orders in January working to streamline the permitting, licensing, and certification processes and created the new Office of Transformation. The governor said, and I quote, State government's top priority should be serving the people of our Commonwealth. But for far too long, Pennsylvanians have had to endure long wait times, outdated systems, and bureaucratic delays. This sounds like something I've said numerous times. But now, we have a Democratic administration singing from the same sheet of music and acknowledging a problem that has plagued our Commonwealth for far too long. Last week, the Independent Fiscal Office highlighted the outmigration of Pennsylvanians to southern states with population losses for every single wage earning category in our state. This is a wake up call, and I have a now former constituent who sums up our problem. You see, he recently moved to one of those southern states. He's a developer who has provided hundreds upon hundreds of jobs to people all across South Central Pennsylvania. And you know why he left? He left Pennsylvania because he could build a new facility in a state like West Virginia from start to finish faster than the time it took him to get a permit from DEP. But it's not just developers. It's teachers, it's nurses, it's realtors. It's anyone who needs a certificate, a permit, or a license from our state. They call all of our district offices complaining about those delays. I have even on occasion remarked that it's the best job security for our district office staff. I have teachers who've had to wait too long to teach in southern York County. In fact, it's so long that they go across the border and teach in Maryland because they can get their certification there much faster. So today, with Senate Bill 350, we are codifying the governor's executive orders to leave a lasting legacy. And it's why we have both labor and business groups agreeing on a specific proposal to move our state forward. It's about jobs. It's about our fiscal future. It's about keeping my children and your children and every Pennsylvanian's children and future generations here in the state of Pennsylvania. I respectfully ask my colleagues to cast an affirmative vote on Senate Bill 350. Thank you, Madam President.